what is going on guys welcome to your second computer networking tutorial and in this video I want to talk to you guys about the different types of computer networks now computer networks pretty much like everything else they can be classified in many different ways for example you can classify a personal network like the one you would have in your home or a professional for businesses or you can classify them according to the different you know types of computers they have you know a cellular network for example but probably the easiest to understand and probably the best starting point whenever you're trying to classify networks is just to classify them according to their reach or size so reach or size and if you hear any moaning uh, that is actually my dog I don't know what he wants right now <laughs> he's just looking at me but anyways let's uh, carry on let's go over the different types really old Dan alright we'll just fight through it the different sizes are a LAN and a LAN is a local area network and first what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna give you guys the three different ones LAN MAN and WAN and then I'll talk about each one in detail so LAN stands for local area network MAN stands for metropolitan area network and WAN is actually a wide area network my dog isn't allowed to uh, come in my room so he usually just sits out in the hallway and he knows he's not supposed to come in so he sits out in the hallway and he looks in and since I'm busy he's slowly inching closer and closer I think that uh, you know he hopes that I won't see him but anyways the first thing the first one I talked about is land so let's go ahead and cover that right now so what is a land well I I said that it's a local area network well what type of computer network does this represent well a local area network pretty much means that all computers are in the same building so here's your building right now you might have a computer here here alright computer 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 and you can you know of course have a printer that's a type of computer too as we talked about earlier but basically LAN which is a local area network this is how you know if your network is a LAN all the computers are in close distance to each other and they're usually in the same house or same building again the building could be either a house or a high school or even you know a small business so say that this is a small business right here this would be an example of a LAN now why would you want a LAN why would you want to connect the computers in a high school or you know even in your home well it's good say this was a college it would be really good for sharing printers and that's how colleges whenever they connect them in this type of network that's why every you know computer in your computer lab it doesn't need its own printer so that's one you know very useful technique of a LAN another thing is you know if this was your house and you know maybe your mom and dad had a computer maybe your sister had a computer and you had a laptop what you could do is you could actually hook this up to the same server oh Dan be quiet I'm trying to teach here and basically all of you guys can store your illegal movies on that same one server so that's really handy but anyways good for sharing things in small or the same building in a close vicinity and these are usually connected by cable or wireless <laughs> okay I gotta let my dog out sorry guys 